the one and only Xalophonia here with Deck Learning. We are here to learn Metal Foes, and not just Metal Foes, the very same deck that Mario used in Yu-Gi-Oh! Fight Club Season 2. Mario, tell us about this deck that lost. It didn't, it's not that it didn't lose as bad, it's just Metal Foes lacks some things in some areas that require another deck to fill in, sadly enough. I was not allowed to use that other side because it's a different archetype. <laughs> Fair enough. So what do we got here? I see a lot of like just normal monsters. What's this deck all about? It's all about the speed pendulums that was from the season that was from the Yu-Gi-Oh before. As you can see on the first Volflame, and then you immediately go over to Go Driver, they all have the same effects. The okay. So you when they kill yourselves, I see. Yeah, because most majority of the time, metaphors have car effects that have when they dis when they're destroyed, they either can bring out another one or add a new one to the hand. Uh, okay, so you can double it up essentially. So yes, you set one metaphor spell or trap card while activating someone else's effect. No, uh, they need to be active face up. Okay. So, but the thing you want to try to do is you wanted to when you activate the pendulum effects you want to activate it on a metal foes monster because once they go to the pen to the extra deck you can bring them right back out as if you just paid no cost to bring out that spell and trap card now how will that work in links because i don't have a ton of pendulum experience in links yet unfortunately because they come from the extra deck they go straight to the extra deck zone Ooh, so that but, can be a little trickier yeah but i do know that there are plenty of cards within Metal Foes that allow you to bring back extra deck cards back to your hand, because once they come from the hand... Then you can start the whole pendulum machine again. But you can't do it from the extra deck in links, you can just do it from your hand in links to for the whole craziness. Because if yeah. you summon them from your hand, they go to anywhere in the field? Yeah, when they when you do it from the hand, they can go anywhere in the field, but if they come okay. from the extra deck, they go straight to the extra deck zone, unless you have a link monster. Very good. And I see, like, Heart of the Underdog taking advantage of all the normal monsters. Is the normal monsters just because that's mostly what's available for Metal Foes? Yes, other than just rare Metal Foes, as you see down there. Basically, yeah, they are all yeah. normal monsters. Okay. And then there's some uh, specific spell and trap cards. Anything I should know about before we begin? Uh, yes. Right down here, you see Metal Foes Fusion and, metal, and rare metal, full Metal Foes Fusion. Uh, yes. Uh, if you're going for a normal play that you want to use during the same turn, Metal Foes Fusion is better. If you want to try to trick me and target the wrong thing, Full Metal Foes Fusion is better. I'm always going to try to trick you, Mario. Yeah, because unfortunately, once you set down a qu uh, quick play onto the field, it's treated as a trap card. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I mean, ooh, so I'd want to pop that out during your turn or something. Cheeky like that. Yeah. Ooh, that is tricky. Okay. And then just a lot of... I see you got some Mirror Forces in here, some Solemn. I see you got um Jar of Avarice. Is that because this deck needs a little bit of a, a re-up or anything? Yeah, because there's some cards that you can't recycle back into the deck, such as the Field Spells and all that. This deck has a lot of recycling power, as you probably saw during the Fight Club. Mm -hmm. But there are certain cards that cannot be returned, and that's what I just rely on the Avarice for. Okay. Sounds good to me. Mm -hmm. So, uh, you ready to test this deck out? See if I can learn it quickly? Oh, yeah, and cheeky little ghost ogres. Just because in Fight Club, you could only use uh, psychics, and they happen to be psychic. Why not? Yep. <laughs> All right, let's try it out. Now, of course, guys, this isn't a uh, flawless Metal Foes deck. This is just the one that was used in Fight Club, so it's only psychic monsters, and we'll see how it does. All right, Mario, how about you go first? Show me the uh, how things go. All right, I'll set this card down, and I activate my emergency teleport. Okay, special summon a level three or lower psychic monster from your hand or deck. Sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, but banish it. But you're probably gonna use um your pendulum effects to destroy it, aren't you? Yep. Okay, so that card doesn't have any downside whatsoever for you. That's nice. Nope. Do like that. It. And let's get out. A Metal Foes counter. Ah, now I started my hand with two Metal Foes counters, so. 
Yeah, they're they're one of your bread and butters of this deck. Basically, when you talk, when a card on your side of the field is destroyed by battle card effect, you can special summon a Metaphos card. Okay. Um, okay, so I have uh, scale one to eight, but those are the only two monsters I have, and I also have metamorph metamorphformation. So do do do. Metamorphformation is your very defensive card. Basically, yeah. when you have a metamorphos card, I might pendulums. as well just play it because this will stop mm -hmm. you from killing my stuff. Sure. With any card packs, yeah. All right, and then I guess I should start by laying out these cards. But we'll see what we do from there. Now, should I activate the effect to get another card? Or should I just wait there? Like, what's more worth it? The effect or having the scale set up? Having, having the set up because you don't want... Because you're practically open right now. If you were to... Okay. You could potentially get a different card that could help you out. Alright, so I guess that's where I'm going to have to end my turn. Nothing offensive at the start, but, you know. We got a little bit of defense here. Mm-hmm. All right. Let's see. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to sacrifice a good card, but that's just to get the playoff. Oh yeah, just so you have something there. Yeah. Very good. Obviously, for those who don't know, Ghost Ogre is normally a hand trap you want to keep in your hand, but he's getting rid of it just for the sake of getting a Metal Foes fusion. And activating these two cards. Ah yes. Oh, you can activate two counters in a turn. Okay, I should yep. put both of mine down. Okay. Hmm. Well, well, well. There we go. Right, then... I assume you're going to fuse these babies up? I would, but I feel like I need to use the Link a little bit more now. Oh, yeah, true, true. So now you have Electrum out here. Mm -hmm. What's he do? Allows me to set, to add to the extra deck, mm, another Volt Flame. Okay. So if you and get the scale set up, you'll be in good position to get two more monsters at least. Mm-hmm. Ooh. And did you use his effect to destroy that card? Yep. Okay. And that'll let you bring a uh, card back to your hand. And you're probably trying to get your scale set up right now, right? Yep. There's the one. All right. Unfortunately. Yep. Or anything Elvis. higher, really. Alright, so I gotta... Oh, I can't activate cards on him either. That's cool. Yeah, because I'm sitting here like, Ha, I got a Quaking Mirror Force. Nope. I can't do anything Quaking, with it. Quaking Mirror Force works on monsters that can be set or send a defense mode. You can't set a Link monster, nor can you set in defense mode. Oh yeah, true. I guess you're right. Never really uh, had that come up before, but yeah, Quaking can't be used on Link monsters. Yeah, okay. uh, that's why Storming Mirror Force is more popular now. Okay, so I still don't have any monsters, but I have two Metal Foes counters. <laughs> and I really want to use some stuff. Well, that's just... what... You could follow the same strategy I just did. Destroy one of your Pendulum Scales to activate both Metal Foes counters. Okay. Um, if I just lay the Metal Foes counter down right now, will I be able to activate it now, or will I have to wait till next turn? Wait until next turn, because it's a trap oh, card. Boy. This is a little risky. I think I do it. Should I just do it for one metal pose counter right now? Nah, I don't know. If you if you can get a free metal pose monster, if you have nothing. Yeah, I, I do have nothing, and I feel like I need to kill Electrum. He just dies if I attack him, right? Yeah. Okay. So, um, is there any uh, preferable thing that I should get here between the uh, scale one and eight that I should take out? Uh, it's it's better to summon out Volfling than to have a mini pendulum scale. All right. Because he is your strongest monster. Alright, so now I can select a card to flip up. So what would I like to suggest for that? Or hit for uh, that? You might want to speed it up because we uh, do Yeah, have tell, a me th tell me what card I want to get then. Okay, okay. Use a um, <laughs> counter. Um, okay, it's telling me to flip up a card. Oh, from the field? Or, well, it's telling me I can do that. So, mm -hmm. use this. Okay, so I All right. probably didn't want mind. a counter right there, so he's fine. It is good because... because well, you no, now I have three counters, so... <laughs> I mean, you could actually all, all... You could play them all at the same time, but... I mean, I can't because I don't have any other monsters. 
but you were about to use your counter, so I would just 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 getting out another Vol Flame because that's your yep. strongest normal monster. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So that's what and I he can is, do. And he is powered up by your uh, field spell right now. Mm-hmm. So a little bit of attack points. Nothing too crazy happening just yet. So we'll see. Oh yeah, I should have done that as well. I can't really use it anyway. All right, so I'm gonna use both of my counters in the grave. Ooh, I can do something from my graveyard. I can banish this card from the graveyard and add a pendulum monster from my extra deck to my hand. Yeah, I want to do that, don't I? With counter. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because then I can get my scale back. That's good. Like, like you didn't even pay a cost. Beautiful. Okay. Now I'm feeling much more better about that whole situation. Very good. But and you can do the same to. thing now. All right. Mm. Okay. There you go. Now you're. Uh, we well, can only bring out uh, one of your guys from the extra deck, but from your hand, we know you got some guys in there. So. Wow. So he comes out. Probably the same one from the extra. Yep. All right. It's fine. Mine has more attack points. It's fine. It's fine. Fine. What else you got? You're being real quiet over there, Mario. I'm going to activate my Metal Force Fusion that I said a while back. <laughs> All right. Ooh, now you can fuse some of these guys together. Obviously, you're going to have to use the Volflame in the special zone. So you can yep. use that zone. And let's go off with one of my favorite ones. Volflame with the Gold Driver. Mithril. Mithrium. Let's activate that. Shuffling two Metal Force cards in the grave back into okay. the deck okay. to set back your Metal Fortration. No! Damn. Lowering your monster so it's weaker than mine. You kind of needed that, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it protects your monsters from almost anything. Mm -hmm. Darn it. I guess now I'll just activate the Quaking. Now I'll activate the Metal Force Fusion. Okay. And what's that gonna do? Gonna give me a strong monster. Okay. And since it's going in defense mode, yeah, I'm gonna do this. Ah, okay. So you at least got to use those guys' material. Okay. Mm-hmm. And I've seen Alcahest before, but remind me what he does again. She, uh, during either player's, actually during your turn, I can take any of your special summon monsters and equip it to my monster, and its attack points become this monster's defense points. Oh no, and my, all my stuff is special summoned. It's alright, I got this, I got this. You ready for this? Mm-hmm. I got this, I got this, I got this, Mario. I got this, okay? I, I'm on my own here, I got this. So, we are going to activate... Get our scale 8 back up with the card I just drew. Stealing. Now, we are going to go ahead. Yeah, come on. Give me some love, crowd. Give me some love. <laughs> Hopefully, they're not cheering for you. <laughs> All right, now we're going to go ahead and just do a pendulum summon right here. And bring out this uh, Vol Flame here. Just, just a Vol Flame. Oh, just, oh, hope nothing happened. Wait, you're not doing anything to it? Uh-oh. Night. Don't it? Uh, huh, no, I could Electrum out here, but will that help me against this guy? I don't think I want to, because you can just take my Electrum, can't you? Yep. Yeah, so. Alright, let's do this, because we can. Let's throw this back on the field. I wanted to have you take my guy and then be like, Ha, I have metamorphomation. But I guess you might be okay. So let's just go for the attack. And hope you take the base. And, oh. Yeah, I, I misread that. Uh, I haven't used Al Alkahest in a while. No, it has to be effect monsters. It actually doesn't work against another Volt. Oh, uh, so since it's all stack. normal monsters. Yeah, because most in Yu-Gi-Oh! are effect monsters lately, of course. Um, okay, so I can actually see you making that mistake. I was like, you're teaching me the deck! But no, that's a yeah rare chance that you'll ever do that. Yeah. So let's return these guys. Mm -hmm. Draw two extra cards. Let's set this card down. 
And right. let's special summon. See, I could have actually probably made a much better play last round, but we'll do what we got to do. Then, hmm. I was scared of the guy on the field when I didn't need to be. <laughs> Let's... Wait, why can't I use those those two? Because they don't work. I don't know. What are you trying to summon? I'm just trying to use a fusion in my hand. Hmm. Oh, right. That's right. Now remember. <laughs> it's the effect of uh, Pot of Riches. Oh, you can't special summon? Yep. That's that. I've had a pot of riches in my hand this whole game, but you can clearly see in my extra deck that I don't need to use it yet. Ooh, yeah. so you got a guy in your hand you're gonna bring out. Oh no, you're just activating the effect to do that stuff. Gotcha. Yeah. Can't do it twice in a turn. Very good, very good. And you got your other metal flows counter. Alright, so this turn should be pretty good for me, assuming you don't block me or anything. Uh, ooh, I got Metal Flows Combination as well. Um, so, honestly, I'm just going to plop that on the field. I don't care if I fill my zones. I'm about to use the two counters. Uh, so, I could go ahead and special summon my uh, Electrum right now. Um, or, I could start by activating the effect to destroy a Vol Flame. What would be better? Because I got two counters on the field. Um, I would say because... Yeah, I would say destroy your, one of your Volt Flames, oh, just okay. so you... Wait, I can only target this guy? Oh, because you already used up all your zones. So? You don't have any more spells and trap cards. But it destroyed a monster. No, Aww. because even if you did, you wouldn't be able to set anything else. Oh, yeah, because it's the set part of the effect. Gotcha. <laughs> Man, I wasn't caring about the set part of the effect. Well, at least I'll get the zones back with the Metal Foes counter. So. Mm -hmm. uh, unfortunately, I'm going to be taking... Oh, I just clicked a random card. Full Metal Foes fusion. That's fine. Let's double counter you. Okay. And so I should be able to special two Metal Foes monsters from my deck. Mm-hmm. Any of them you want. Okay, what do I want? Let's see. I guess just power. Um, is there any like specific stuff? Because I'm probably going to get a fusion out this turn. Uh, not really. Uh, None of them that... Not any of them that really give you anything special. Okay. Theoretically, I might be able to kill you this turn if I just get another roll flame. And let's just grab one of these guys because you had one. So it must be a good idea, right? Mainly, I just having I like the diversity of having all the one innates yeah. already in play. Ooh, I can get Psybeast Diablosis. Yeah, that's a good way of banishing my deck, making sure I don't get any comebacks. Hmm, <laughs> but I'm pretty sure you're not going to if I just attack with these guys. Well, theoretically, you could get both. You could get your Link Monster and Diablosis. Yeah, but then I wouldn't beat you this turn. I have more attack points on the field as is. Wouldn't I want to take the chance since those two set cards you have on the field you didn't use before, so they're probably nothing that's going to stop me? I mean, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to bring my Link Monster out just because I can still do it and have the Link Monster. And what's his effect again? Let's see. I can take get rid of something. I don't want to do that. Because the thing's blocked up anyway, so I guess I'll just attack like this. Because I could special summon Diablosis, but then I wouldn't be able to kill you. So, actually, I, never mind. I can't kill you this turn anyway. With I messed up my math. I believed in myself too much. All right, <laughs> so we'll try him out. So what's this guy's effect again? Basically, tar activate his effect. All right. You can look at my extra deck and basically choose a card to banish. I'll banish Electrum because we're playing links. All right. I have another effect. Sure, what do I do? I don't have much time left. So, okay. You banish the top card of my deck equal to the amount of battle. Let's take out. Ooh, I can't take out your stealing. Because I'm weak. I only got 2,000 something. And then oh, you can activate that just when I kill a guy, too. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Whenever a monster. Whenever a Metaphor's card is destroyed by battle or card effect. Oh, man. Oh, I can activate another effect. Sure. What do I do? Select a card to banish. 
on option. my graveyard. Oh, uh, okay. Um, it's probably not going to be a huge difference. So. Oh, counters in your graveyard. You want to banish that on your own accord. Can I activate it now? No, it won't nope. let me. Hey, I made a good play. Um, but still, next turn's going to be iffy, so we'll end the turn there. And I've really got to find a way to get this card out of my pendulum zone. Well, let's activate my Jar of Everest, then. All right. Let's recycle some of these cards back in. Sure. Not that you have too many, but... All right. Go for it. Oh, awesome. <laughs> and what'd you get? Metamor oh, that'll even it out. Ooh, I can use Metal Foes combination now. If a fusion monster is fusion summoned, you can target one Metal Foes monster in your graveyard with a lower level than a fusion monster. Special summon it. Eh. Yeah, I think most of them have lower level than the fusion monsters, including Volflame. Sure. Mm -hmm. Might as well pop this, right? Yeah. And plus, that's actually a good target for your pendulums, because it has a destruction effect. Very good. All right. Oh, it's just let me flip it up because it's continuous, but I have to activate it on my own turn. Got it. Mm -hmm. Let's activate full metaphors. Well, I can do something from my graveyard. I think it's just letting you activate your uh, counter. Yeah, and that lets me banish a card from Yeah, I kind of want to do that anyway, so. Might as well do it. Before you get rid of my counters like I got rid of yours. I'm only going to do one, so I increase the tension. Uh, let's go ahead and grab just this other scale 8 dude. We'll keep the uh, the tough guy in there in case I can summon him like that. Yep. Uh, You know what? I think at this point, I think I just need pure power. So let's do these. Sending these three to the grave. Bring out Trap hole. Crimson Knight. Ooh, Metal Foes combination. I can affect it again. So... Let's activate it. And special summon. Oh, that's cool, I guess. Oh, and I can full Metal Foes Fusion now. I should probably consider doing that, because you're going to destroy my tough guy. <laughs> Let's hit it and see what happens. Because I think I might be able to match you. Yeah, I can. Hmm. Yeah, I think I just want to match you. Just so I have some equal. So I'm going to use this. And, oh, I got to use a guy from the field. Well, let's be honest. Electrum's going down anyway. So. <laughs> Wait, I got to use all three? What? It's a, um, Electrum is the strongest, but it needs three monsters. Oh, no. I wish I didn't do that. <laughs> One Metaphors monster plus two monsters with 3,000. Oh, it, it, darn it. It didn't go in the order I wanted to. I wanted to use this guy for it. Oh, well. Ah. Should have waited. I didn't know it was going to chain up in that order, so. Thought it was going to do it in the order that I hit the cards in, not the order it wanted to. Yeah, might as well have Crimson Knight destroy your Volt Flame. Okay, darn it. That puts me in an awkward position. Um, not a super awkward position. Yeah, we'll just uh, let you do that there. Okay. It's all good. Heart of the cards, heart of the cards. No, I think I do have a play I can make happen here. Okay, just drew a Ghost Ogre. I'll hold on to that. But we uh, need to get some pendulums out here. Because I can trade with you, and that will probably be worth it, considering your field. And your no cards in your hand. But we're going to activate our last one there. And, uh, ooh, the only one we have is him. It's, uh, it's fine, we have two of them. So I'm going to go ahead and activate him over here. And um, I can now special some Oh, wait, I can't. Oh, I'd have to attack and then summon. Oh, boy. Because the link zone, right? Yep. Hmm. It, it's okay. coming from your extra deck, so. Yikes. Well, I can uh, pull out my Ghost Ogre and do the same thing as you as trading that. Is there anything that could help me in this situation right now? Uh, Yeah, there is. All right. Use, you forget about using Silver. <laughs> I don't forget. I don't know the card. I was going to say, uh, you should have targeted your combination because it has a, gr has a destruction effect to add one Metal Force mm -hmm. card from your deck to your hand. Don't they all do that? Or yeah, but I'm saying like you could have Pendulum summoned somebody from the hand and had a, an attack me directly this turn. Wait, how could I have done that if I destroyed my Pendulum Zone? No, no, no. If you use Silvered, 
destroy Metaphor's combination, the trap card, you could have oh. added one to your hand. Okay, I thought you had to destroy a monster. Oh no, just any face-up card you control. Okay, mm -hmm. that's cool. Yeah, so I don't think a fusion is going to help me at all in this situation. So. Alright, so it didn't help me at all. Um, but still, you could I... You could activate more than one destruction effect. If oh, you yeah. target the other one. Sure, let's try it out now. And darn it, I have to fill up my zones, I don't want to. I don't need these cards down there. Okay, so now I can use that graveyard effect. Okay, mm -hmm. cool. And I can do some things. So, I guess we just want some raw power, which I'm starting to run low on, so... Let's get Gold Driver. And... Huh. I think what I want to do here is attack and then in my main phase 2 make the plays. Because I could get, like, 1900 life points on you right now, but that's just going to be a scratch. So let's... Oh, wait, I can't bring them both out anyway. Yeah, true. Oh, well. <laughs> Jeez, still getting used to Lynx while getting used to another deck is awkward. Yep. Alright, so now we'll just special summon, I guess, Volflame. Because that was the original mediocre plan. Oh, no, we can summon two. Can we? Oh, yeah, because these are in my hand. Duh, I forgot yep. about that part. Okay. And... Wait, what? Do I get three? I don't think I get three. From my hand, and... Hey, I hit Vault Flame! Jerk. Sorry, I can now... Oh, I can only bring out Electrum. Grr. Uh, but I can Metal Force Fusion, and see what I can do with that. Just to get some power out. Who's a good defensive one to bring out? Normally it's Alcahaz, but against this deck, that might yeah, not be the not best so option. Much. Um, let's see, this one... What's the 2600 do? The, uh, 2600? Yeah. This card sent from the field to the graveyard, special summon another pendulum monster. That might be what I want to go for. Uh, yeah. If you feel like, uh... Okay. Just because that has a little backup plan to it. Yep. It's still got pretty good power. I can activate to send two pendulum things to... Can I do it on your stuff? I don't know. Yep. Face. You can target... Yep. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to do set this card down. That's yeah, looking option. at your empty hand and your empty field, I assume there wasn't a lot of options for you, so. Um, let's see, so, I can target two metal foes in my graveyard and one on the field. Shuffle the targets from the graveyard into the deck. Let's activate it and see what happens. Alright, so two in the graveyard. I want to return them to the deck. So, ooh, shame I banished all my counters. Um, but let's grab Combination and Volflame, I'd say. Those are some good ones. And I'll select, uh... I guess you're silvered, just so there's no chance of you getting any chance here. Oh, it just goes back to the hand. Okay. No big deal yeah. then. And let's see. I should be able to take you this round, unless that's a sick trap card. Uh, ooh, I could full Metal Foes Fusion. Um, but I'm scared. Just monsters from my hand is Fusion. I have one monster in my hand. How would that work? <laughs> nope, not doing that. All right, but we will go ahead and special summon some stuff. We're gonna do that, and don't I get one from the back here too? What? Why did that not work? Hmm. No idea. Yeah, it just didn't let me bring out another one. Is that someone's effect? Let's see. You can only use a. No, oh, that's not that. I don't know. Um, but regardless, that should be enough. So let me see that mirror force. I have not drawn one Mirror Force this entire yeah, game. I was banking on that. <laughs> Let me just show you what my face down card was. Oh, so good card. Well, I guess. Did you have any? Oh, yeah, you did have one card. So that's good. Do that. And I'll oh, full Metal Fields Fusion to counter it. Yeah, but I just need the damage. And whew, thank goodness that didn't shave off the damage I needed to beat you. Yeah, this would have gone the other way if I had one more card in my hand when I drew this. When we had mm -hmm. both of the fusions out. All right, because so it seems the basis of this deck is just a lot of... Oh, yeah, because then you could have gotten the damage over me. Yep. <laughs> yeah, so it seems like the uh, basis of this is pr pretty easy, just normal pendulums, but then, like, all the specific uses of the cards is what I I'll need to learn. So, let's do a rematch now. No hold no in my teaching? hand. Even though, yeah, you <laughs> barely taught me anything there anyway, but... Well, it's mainly... <laughs> it was a lot of teaching me the things after I did the other thing. <laughs> It's fine. It's fine. It's alright. I'll take out my vengeance on you right now. 
Alright, what you doing, man? You being real quiet again. Well, I'm thinking. With oh. metaphors, there's a lot of thinking involved. Well, don't think and be quiet. That's boring. Alright, so I have a... Two scale ones. Alright. So let's activate this. And I might even just normal summon. Because why not? And then I can activate the effect on it. So let's do that. That's actually smart. And uh, that'll just let me set one more card. But that's... I can probably gamble on that being worth it. And probably you won't counter in this situation, I'm guessing, so. But just having counter is just a good card. Yeah. Alright, I think I have to end my turn there as well. Uh, actually, I have Metamorphomation. I guess I should, might as well put that up. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Alright. Hmm. Kinda yeah. And when I ask you questions, you can still answer me. It's just, you know, we're going to be yeah, playing that. for real now. Yeah, that's why I would This is for the audience to learn, not for me. <laughs> I would have suggested you attacked first, then activated your silver. You would have gotten to back. Oh, yeah, I could have done that. Well, you know, you never know what trap cards you have down there. Ooh, you got nothing either, huh? Oh, neither do I. Well, I can, uh... I can pull the old ghost ogre sacrifice. I think I may <laughs> have to do it, because I got two counters on the field right now, so let's do it. I'm going to say that's worth it for a ghost ogre. Uh, or I could get rid of my field card, but Ghost Oak is already out here. So, do, 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 do. oh, I could cancel my own effect. <laughs> um, so, what, oh, geez, we have to put a card down in the Pendulum Zone again. It's all right. It's no big deal. Uh, let's see. What's something that I can get rid of quickly? Probably counter. <laughs> all right, all three counters are on the field, Mario. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so counters up. Counters up. Uh, now I got no- Ooh, I should have grabbed a fusion, actually. Because then I could have actually used it. Oh, well. Uh, so, let's go ahead and bring out you. And I don't think I'm going to do my link. Well, maybe I'll do link. Nah, no, I think I want to have these guys out on the field for now. Because I don't have, like, bounce back power um, with the pendulums or anything. So Not right now, no. You don't have the so proper setup. I, I think I literally just want to have some powerhouses on the field. Cause like I could go into my link monster right now, but that's you can retaliate against that. Oh, or I could go into Diablosis. And what's his jam again? Let's you, see. You still are banishing my extra deck and deck. Yeah, and he has the same power, so that's a decent play to do at the end. So, because if I can stop your links from happening before they happen, that's pretty good. Do that attack damage, and let's get Diablosis out here. Now, unfortunately, these guys are going to go to the graveyard, right? Yeah, because overlay units just count as normal cards. Oh, yeah, once they do that, yeah, so. All right. Ah, I could save. But that's Ooh. a lot of my life points left. Yeah, so I just need to tap you and it's over. But I have few moves left looking at my field and looking at my hand. So I'm, I'm going to need to rely on draw power. You got four cards in your hand. Ooh, a face down monster. Probably one of the ones with zero attack points, I'm guessing. <laughs> it wouldn't be a stealing by any chance, would it? Maybe. <laughs> Alright, um, so I can activate something from the graveyard. I can do a Metal Foes, and yes, that'd be great. So I can bring this guy back. And now, let's see. Because I had a another monster in my hand, but it's a steal and I just drew, so it's a scale 8. So I'm assuming I want to use this guy in my hand as the sacrifice. Because then I can set up scales afterwards. Hey, look at that. I could take you out. Um, do I attack first and then do that? Um, I don't really have anything to pendulum summon, so I think I should attack first. It's a bigger risk. Um, but hey, no risk, no reward. Let's just set you back a bit. Ooh, that'll slow the play down for sure. Okay. Oh, no, I can't activate counter on that? Oh, because I didn't even do the thing yet. Darn it! That nope. sets me back a lot. Okay. Um, well, let's see. I can still do some stuff. Unfortunately, it's going to mean clearing my field, but do I want to clear my field right now when you have nothing? Hmm, that's tricky. That's tricky. Because I can... Uh, I'll just activate it now because I can. Stealing can come out. 
and I could activate the effect, but I don't have a, yeah, I don't have a counter to bank on right now, so it would literally be just me getting out of card, and that's my last and final counter. So, oh, what I could do, actually, might as well get this other guy back in my hand, and I can set these guys up this turn, not that I can use them for anything. I kind of just want to have the field defense at the moment, and if he, you know, dies, then good thing he was out there. If he lives, uh. I can get rid of him next turn. I had gotten the worst possible hand from the start. Good. Yeah, just looking at what you had, I was like, you're going to have to bank on luck to come back, same as me, so. Oh, jeez. Oh, gross. Well, at least yeah. I can make do with that. When I, in this kind of deck, you don't want to draw all, all the utility cards yeah. on the first Yeah, I mean, Twin Twisters is great against this, sure, but that's not exactly what you wanted right there. No, uh, I needed a Metaphors card monster in general. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Yeah, so I can get that guy back, um, but there's really no point in me worrying about it because you had plenty of opportunities to activate that face down before and you did not. Ba -ba -ba. Yeah, Ooh. it was just and a few. Ignite Reload from my hand. It can reveal any amount of pendulum monsters from my hand and shuffle them into the deck and then draw some cards. Sure, let's try it out. You get a plus two for just one pendulum card you throw back. Oh, really? Okay. Hey, nice. Woo! All right, yeah. that was quick. If you want to do one more quick one, I'm down. Sure. Just so we can learn some of this stuff. Because I just used beat sticks on you. That wasn't much learning. Okay, this is a much better hand. This is a... I don't like my hand. <laughs> um, okay, I got some potential. Ooh, we can see some uh, Heart of the Underdog for once. That's good. Alright, so is it bad if I got my riches and two fusions in uh, my first hand with no monsters? I feel like it's bad. Probably. <laughs> I don't think it's a probably. I think it's just bad. Hmm. I could bring out the Link Monster right now, but I don't think that's that's weaker than both my monsters on the field yeah, right now. Yeah, so. exactly. I feel like with this deck, you kind of got to time it. So, let's see what I can do while Mario seems to go silent for some reason, I assume. Hmm. All right. So, um, let's see. Let's so, I got two Twin Twisters, two Fusions, and a Pot of Riches. Woo! What a hand! Um, let's see, I probably should use one of the Twin Twisters, getting rid of the other Twin Twisters to slow you down entirely. I do fortunately have one usable card here, Emergency Teleport. But I don't think I want to use this right now, because I can't use it on anything successfully. Because if, if I use Emergency Teleport, I'll just be bringing out a monster and I don't have any way of getting rid of him. Not even a Pendulum monster to destroy him? No, I have no monsters. Yeah, then it would just be banished and it would be completely useless to you. Yeah, so I have nothing in the hand! Well, let's slow you down from beating me immediately. Let's get rid of a... Since I have two of the fusions in my hand, I think I'm going to get rid of one, one of them rather than the uh, twin twisters. Because I feel like the other twin twisters could potentially slow you down a little bit more. So, let's do that. Let's do that. Oh, that's actually a decent play because now you can return the fusion back to your deck and draw an extra card. Ooh, that is sick, actually. Um, let's get rid of your heart of the underdog because you have an empty hand and I don't want that to change. Activate. Sweet. Okay, I didn't know it had that secondary effect. Yes, I got a monster. Um, it's not better than any of your monsters. However, I can uh, put this in the pendulum zone. And emergency teleport will come into play. Yay, I have moves I can do! <laughs> okay, that was about to be bad, man. <laughs> Alright, so literally anything? Ooh, what if I bring out the um, the effect one? Oh, the red metaphors. That is the best option, because then you get an extra metaphors at the end of your yes. turn. Yes, beautiful. Okay, so I just want to activate and get rid of it, I'm assuming. Mm -hmm. uh, yep, <laughs> I don't have many other options. So... Let's do that, and now a card to flip up, you know we grab in that counter. And another card, I'm guessing. Ooh, effect? Yeah, I want to use that effect. It activates at the end of your turn. Okay, good to know. And let's see, I got the quick play fusion card, so let's pop that down. End my turn. Um, I, suck if I don't want to resolve any effect. What? What's this trying to do? Oh, oh it's trying to it's, Yeah, the... the UI and this is weird. Okay, so I get a card to my hand. Um, so I got a level one. We should grab a level eight. And this guy also happens to be Volflame. So it's always a benefit. Or a scale one and a scale eight. All right, so you drew one card instead of the multiple you may have gotten with Heart of the Underdog. 
So that's uh, one little advantage I made. However, I am going to take some hits this turn. Yeah, that's gonna so. be this is gonna be over half your life points. Yeah, but I set myself up so I can have plays in the future. So yeah, that's the important then, thing. You have the comeback power right now. I don't. <laughs> exactly. Okay, so I didn't. Oh, I drew another. I drew a ghost ogre. Huh. Ooh, so I could pull up my Volflame Pendulum Summon my uh, guy in there, and then I'll get another two things. That might be good. But it's also going to limit me again. But let's see what we can do. Yeah, so I want to activate this because, yeah. And so I think we just want to go ahead and special summon. Oh, uh, no, I don't want to special summon you. Uh, how do I special summon from the extra deck? Oh, Rare Metaphose is the exception because that's a straight level one. Oh, it is. I can't. Oh, darn it. That I, Well, I guess that wouldn't have changed anything I would have done. All right, well, we're doing the trusty old Ghost Ogre sacrifice. I guess Ghost Ogre is really a good call, because, like, even if you don't use its effect, you can just sacrifice it. Yeah. So, let's get rid of it. And... Oh, boy. What do we want here? I can only get out one monster here. Because I only got one counter. I guess I'll... Yeah. Because I'm definitely not fusing anything right away. Let's just get our second counter out here. And then we'll activate the counter we have. And I think I'm just going to have to get a Vol Flame and match your power. Take out Gold Driver. Yeah, it doesn't seem like there's any other play to make. Um, unless I wanted to bring out my other guy and get another two cards. But actually, hold up. Oh, no, I just used the effect to destroy. No, I can keep doing that, right? Um, uh... Have I... Let's see. Not this is, is sure this to the hand playing. or the field? Uh, Metaphos, the Metaphos counter goes straight to your field. To the field. Alright, I'm just going to gamble real hard then. Mmm. Alright, and let's activate. Get... Okay, I can see your play. Good. It's good that one of us does. Alright, and let's see what I can grab here. Um, do I just grab the other counter, or... Hmm. Yeah, I'm not doing any fusions anytime soon, so let's just counter. Counter is the card I know! Alright, <laughs> and let's use the effect from here. And that lets me do something else, right? Do you have a defensive monster you can set up? Um, does this let me do that? Nope, and you're about to run out of time. <laughs> ah, thanks. Oh, no, it wasn't. I had a little bit of time. Oh, no, it's to my hand. Oh, darn it. All right, yeah. Well. All right, didn't know that was going to be the effect. Well, I was about to get back my monsters that you would have destroyed anyway. Because I just drew a steal well, in. one of them. Yeah. So. Um, then, yeah, it would have been fine. But, nope. I gambled when I could have... You know, saved myself. Mm. Darn it. Yeah, let's just... I mean, if you want to give me a turn there, just because... You know, I didn't know what... Okay, that's not that's not good either. That's not what I meant. Um, huh. Well, uh-oh. That's not good. Yeah, that's not good. Confirm the card. cards. Yeah, there you go. Pick. Pick and choose wisely. What'd you get rid of? Your uh, Link Monster like you did yeah. to mine. <laughs> that just seems like the smart play. See, I might as well do this while I can. Yeah, just another oh, sacrifice. Back. Yep, pretty much. Okay. So I can fill Metal Foes Fusion. Actually, hold up. We might have something. I don't know if I have something, but let's activate the card out of desperation. Uh, I can get 2800. Can't get that strong guy, but I can get 2,800. Uh, ooh, he's an effect monster. The other guy's not, though. Uh, I could take control of him, though, with Alkahest. How would that work out, huh? It would put you, it would put him in your spell and trap card zone, yeah. Okay, and then my dude would gain your uh, attack as defense points? Yep. Let's try him out. All right, so let's fuse these two. Do that. Okay, so I actually can save myself from this. Activate. Sweet. 
Go slow, go slow, rabbit. Ah, jerk. <laughs> but that still got rid of him. Nah, I'm fine, bro. I got two counters on the field. I'm actually still in this. <laughs> All right, let's get the power. Don't mess with me. Don't mess with me. Th thought your ghost ogre would be helpful. Hey, I, I did get rid of the alkaz, which would have been a potential problem later on. Let's see. And so I can have another monster out here. And you don't get crazy and trade on me. I'm just going to go defense mode. I, I'm in such good shape now, man. Okay. Yep. Actually, misplay didn't matter at all. I had so much comeback power, it didn't matter. Yeah, it's something to do this. Smart. Just so I can get a counter. Okay. Now, if I destroy your dude, you'll be able to counter and everything. Mm hmm. You know, unless I would say it's using the second twin twisters that I was complaining about. Now. If I take both your silvered and your counter, will you be able to activate counter? No, it's it's I can't activate it on the same sequence as an effect that goes okay. after. I was about to I was about to say, because if this is the case, I will just take out the counter if I have to. Okay, so that should set me up for <laughs> actually damaging your life points for once. Yeah, uh counter only activates after the mm -hmm. after the card is sent to the grave. Yeah, so I think um Ooh, can I not pendulum summon? Oh yeah, because I can't do the, the level one dude. That's why. All right, but I could bring it back to my hand with another counter. So let's do that, just so I can have his effect come into play. And let's see, what can I special summon? Only the Link monster, and I don't have any fusions. So we're just gonna be sitting on the field right now, so although you have no cards, you might have some comeback potential, because it's gonna take multiple turns to take you out. And ooh, I can grab a uh, fusion card right now, so. Let's see, yeah, let's definitely just grab the normal one because I'm going to be taking time anyway. And activate this. Beautiful. Oh, I, did I not do that? Yeah, I don't think I did that. Oh, well. No big deal. <laughs> Too many prompts in this game. And yeah, let's just kill. So you have literally nothing to work with. Nope, it's all heart of the cards right now. Yeah, that's a, that's a difficult heart of the cards. <laughs> And, you know, placing the mirror force down for the lulls. Um, select an effect. Oh, yeah, never mind. That happens at the end of the turn. I keep forgetting that. Mm -hmm. uh, nothing crazy to bring out, so let's just get a gold driver. Just straight power. Yep, pretty much. And, you know, I do have the fusion now, so I can bring out the tough guy, I think. I think. Can I do this? Alright. So you'll have something. Uh, actually, yeah, drawing a card and having those in your graveyard, there are plays you can make. If you got the mm -hmm. two scales right now, you could at least pendulum summon someone. But what you're probably going to do is just burn something, right? Oh, you're going to pendulum summon, then burn it, aren't you? Aren't you? Probably. Yeah, because you don't have the kind of power to fight either of my cards on the field. Okay. So you got your scale set back up, and I've burned both of my twin twisters. And you have plenty of life points, so you can take a hit from me if you need to. Yep. Uh, let's mm -hmm. see. I'm going to have to bank it. Alright. Yeah. Ooh. Have you used all your counters? No, I haven't, but if I just draw one card, it's not good. It's yeah, it's not, not going to be helpful, helpful anyway. Jeez, I have so much things I can activate right now. Let's see what I can special summon. Just Electrum. Let me just double check his effect. I can target one other face-up card I control, destroy it, then add a Pendulum monster from my extra deck to my hand. That's not a bad idea. Um, but I need to have another... I can normal summon and do that. Let's see. And if a card leaves my Pendulum zone. Ooh, that could be fun. Okay. So I'm going to bring out... Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Let's br let's try to work with the Link monster. Obviously, I could just fusion into my tough guy, but let's try this out. Ooh, and I can activate Full Metal Flow's fusion from my hand. Nah. And add to the extra deck. Oh, add to the extra deck? Oh, yeah, that is what that does, isn't it? Um, I don't know. <laughs> this is good something there. I don't care. That's not what I'm doing this for. I'm doing this so I can activate his effect and destroy my gold driver. And then I can add to my hand. Oh. That was a mistake, but it's something. It doesn't matter. Then, I can go ahead and draw a card. 
Sweet. Now I'm going to activate my other gold driver. <laughs> so I didn't lose anything out of that. It's pretty cool. Uh, let's see now. Fusion's probably not a good idea to do right now. Let's see. F monsters from the field and hand, I'm guessing. So I only have one in my hand. Oh, but I can uh, pendulum. Uh, oh, yeah. Pendulum summoning is actually going to work right now because I have the link monster. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Okay. Let's go for it. And I can bring out... You. It would be better if there was, if it highlighted all your bottom row. <laughs> That'd be crazy, but, you know, it, you gotta work with what you're given in the game. Yeah. Um, okay, so you can only go there, making sure I put them all in the right spots. I guess it's only gonna let me put them in the right spots. Thank you, game, for idiot-proofing me. Okay, so boom, we got three monsters out. Can oh, that is that be? enough? It might be close. It's definitely gonna be a lot closer than if I do any special summoning. So, ooh, I should have um, activated my last uh, Metal Foes from the Grave. Got something else to my hand. No, I couldn't have done anything. No, I could have done another thing from the hand. Oh, well, let's go for some attacks, and then if we decide to fuse anything afterwards, we will do just that. All right. Yeah, this is enough. All right, the comeback. <laughs> Jeez, I started with a terrible hand. <laughs> yeah. But this deck does have comeback potential, luckily, so... It does that. have a lot, yeah. That's why I Ooh. chose it over side frames during... I'm actually going to try this out a little bit. And let's go ahead and bring you out. Oh, uh, just being out the biggest guy in the deck. Why not, you know? <laughs> and you can trick it out, and you can fusion with the guys you already attacked with. Yeah, that's a good thing about the that's quick play good. fusion. Yeah. I, I do like that about the quick play fusion. Okay. Uh, Mario, I think I learned the deck. <laughs> yep. Obviously, there's a ton of other plays, and I was just spamming my counter and everything, and so. And this is just a pure metaphor version. You could mix yeah. it up with another Pendulum deck, like Ignites, and it works okay. just as well. Cool. Yeah, because there's still a lot of Pendulum summoning that you could do. Now, obviously, as all Pendulum stuff, it's better before Link's. Um, but hey, it's possible with this. Like, I, I'm happy that we at least got one effective Electrum play done this game at the very end there. So, <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, having him, you know, take out the guy I already had in my hand so we could draw a card that would let me do this play here. So, guys, if you have enjoyed this little bit of a lesson, make sure to leave a like on the video. Give a thanks to Mario for teaching me this. And, uh, you know, keep watching Fight Club because there's a Fight Club deck and Fight Club's just getting spicy right now. Um, if you have enjoyed this, then subscribe and hit, you know, click the bell like this name says over here. And we will see you next time.